Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman has been feted in the White House, but now in papers before a Washington DC court, he's alleged to have ordered death squads to torture and assassinate opponents. The case has been brought by a former Saudi intelligence officer, Saad Al Jabri, who alleges the Crown Prince sent a team called the Tiger Squad to Canada to kill him. The court papers say the men were denied entry by suspicious Canadian border guards. This detailed flowchart submitted to the court identifies key members of the assassination squad and others involved, including what are described as forensic technicians skilled in criminal evidence removal. A mirror image of the hit squad that is believed to have murdered and dismembered journalist Jamal Khashoggi in Istanbul in 2018. I know that there are women and men uh, all over the world, uh, in Germany and France and the United States and Canada, uh, who have uh, really basically run away from Saudi Arabia because they are afraid of uh, repercussions uh, from the government, and uh, which is now uh, in, uh, totally in the hands of Mohammed bin Salman. One of them is Omar Abdelaziz, also resident in Canada. Mentioned in the court filing as another potential target of assassination and who posted this video in reaction to the news. The case has been brought in terms of legislation that allows non-U.S. citizens to take action in federal courts against foreign individuals who have committed torture and or extrajudicial killings. In addition, Saad al-Jabri argues that the hit squad assembled in the United States before attempting to enter Canada. Saad al-Jabri's children, now aged 20 and 21, are being held at an undisclosed location in Saudi Arabia as what he describes as human bait to draw him out of hiding. Last month, four senators sent a letter to President Trump saying the US had a moral obligation to press Saudi authorities for their release. The president in the past has made clear that regardless of the allegations of human rights violations against the Saudi Crown Prince, Mohammed bin Salman remains a valued ally and friend. Mike Hanna, Al Jazeera, Washington.